guys okay it is friday fun day and it is time for another bold lips for old chicks okay so today i have now i, I don't be mad you guys <laughs> i might do a two-in-one today because um just because i have one that i want to try and uh but um there's no name on it so um i don't want to hear like you know you why you don't even know the name of it how am i gonna get it so anyway we might do two. I'll think about it. We'll see what how, how this goes. All right, so I've got today the matte metallic, which, you know, can't be matte if it's a metallic. Liquid lipstick from Ulta. This was a free gift with purchase, and I did try it. I have tried it on before on camera, but I did want to try it again because it is kind of a bold lip, and it is, it's kind, it's a metallic, so, but it's supposed to be a budge-proof metallic, so in case you guys haven't seen <laughs> that video that I did before, you should really look it up though because they're all good <clears throat> we're gonna try this on today all right so again metallic liquid lip and again no shade but this is the what it looks like it's sort of like a garnet kind of color it's really pretty so but it is a little bit bold so we'll just see yeah it's like a brownie mauve shade. It's really pretty. I feel like this sort of a formula very similarly to the Jordana matte liquid lipsticks is very thin. So you'll get sort of a line that will go all the way down and a lot of the product will slide down to the edge of your lip. This is a look for sure. Like on camera, it's just kind of looking like it's just a glossy lip. In real life, it's definitely like a metallic lip um and honestly i'm gonna get my it's really like a mauvey brown but in a metallic so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna compare it against the one that i did last time which is the jordana sweet cream liquid lip in the shade cinnamon toast and we're just gonna see like how the shades compare this one obviously is a shim is a metallic and then the Jordana one is a matte. Oh, it's le the Jordana one's a lot deeper and more brown. <clears throat> this is the one I'm wearing right now, which is the Ulta brand metallic matte metallic liquid lipstick. I don't know the shade, sorry. Um, and then this one is the Jordana Sweet Cream matte liquid lip color in the shade Cinnamon Toast. So much deeper and much more brown. I like them both. I think they're both very pretty. I don't know. I feel like I kind of like um, the matte better than this really shiny metallic. But again, we're trying bold lips, ladies. So you guys let me know what you think of that. I'm going to grab a tissue and we're just going to see how the um, transfer is. Oh, not much transfer. So the one thing that's nice about this, though, there's a little bit of transfer, but not a lot, is that it feels really comfortable. Like it's going to be long lasting or so it says, and I think that's probably true. I don't know that I wore it for very long when I tried it on any, even in the other video, um, just because it's a little bit out of my comfort zone, um, even though it's still really pretty and everything. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, so even though it's gonna be long lasting, it I feel like it's much more comfortable than these matte ones. So there's that one. And I think I'll go ahead and try this one today since it's, oh, where are we at? It's not, not very long in these videos. Um, and since we have the name on this one. This one, I talked about this one last time. This is the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Suede. So let's get this off and then we'll try that one. This Garnety colored one is 
almost an exact dupe for a Mary Kay lipstick that I used to wear when I was in my mid-teens, 14, 15. I think the color, the name of that color was actually Garnet. All right, so that came off pretty easily with some just regular old lip gloss, and I find that to be true with a lot of liquid lipsticks. They are easily removed with any sort of oil-based slash wax-based lip gloss, chapstick, anything like that. These ones, on the other hand, the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color, are very difficult to get off. You have to have um, an oil base, like coconut oil, olive oil, something like that. These um, lip glosses that I usually use to take off my liquid lipsticks, it won't work. It won't take them off at all. So again, this is the shade Suede, and I'm gonna, let's have a, it's a little bit lighter, that mauve brown shade. So let's try this one out as well. Oh, this is very beigey. Beigey brown. This might actually make me look a little bit dead. a little bit dead with a shade like this so not my favorite this one like I like the color of it just on, when it's not on my lips but on my lips it's looking a little bit mm, yeah not my favorite with this one so let me know what you guys think about either of these two colors um, if you like the series um, let me know in the comments below let me know any colors shades um, brands of lip products that you would want me to try or are curious about any suggestions you have like that in the comments i would really appreciate it um don't forget to thumbs up like subscribe ding my bell and i'll see you in the next one bye